Hello guys, and what's up everybody? I'm just gonna be making a little nice video today. So basically what I thought I'd do... Oops, somebody's noticed me. Hello, Wumples. <laughs> I'm just gonna be making a little short video of me, you know. What I want to try to do is try to commentate over a Hunger Games, like, live. Or, not live, you know, while playing. Instead of, like, I know a lot of people, they do all the fighting and stuff. And then they commentate over it. But I want to try it the other way and commentate over it. You know, once it's while it's happening, because I think that'll be a lot more fun, and it's it's a lot harder to do because you have to talk and fight. So it's not as easy as just sitting here, you know, concentrating, being able to click every single button easily because you know you can like you can tell what you're doing. Whereas when you're trying to talk at the same time, it's not that easy. So, I've gone kit cultivator, which, you know, some of you may think, uh, why have you gone that kit? It's like a support kit. But no, I, I really, really like it. I like the idea of being able to grow trees instantly. It really helps for when you're running away. Um, the food is really helpful if you ever need the food. I mean, most of the time you won't, but if you ever do, I mean, like, right now I've got, you know, I've got soups, so I could use soups, but I prefer not to. So what I'm going to try to do is get... Not a full set of iron, but I'm going to get, like, um, you know, a sword and maybe a hat or a shirt or something. And then I'm going to go out and fight. Because I feel that that's a lot safer. Okay, so I found some iron. Oh, God. Full gold zombie. Kill him in a second. It's kind of weird. I've never seen one of those before. Just randomly spawn on Hunger Games. Okay, let's hope I don't just get jumped from above or something. That's normally what happens. I always end up dying like that. Somebody just jumps straight in my head and I'm just like, dead. <laughs> okay. Let's make some soups. There we go. Now, I am going to need supplies. And what I do like is I don't have to rush in the beginning. Like, I don't have to... Like, I do still have to rush a bit. But I don't have to rush to the point where I just have to jump through everything. Let's see if this guy will drop me some armor. Highly doubt it, but Ayo, worth a shot. Nope. Stupid zombie. See, I have no idea where I was last talking about. You see, because I'm like concentrating on trying not to get killed. Wamples is speaking to me. Tempted to say hey, but I'm in the middle of a video, so I probably won't. His closest person is Shotty. He's probably run off as well or died. Because a lot of people just die straight away. Pros and stuff. When they come back to life. And then they're always out near me when I run away. So it's not that bad. Not that bad. I mean, they're, they're pretty easy to pick off. But then when you get, like, fought, when you get, like, a pro run at you with a wooden sword, then you don't have any food, and another pro runs at you with a wooden sword, and it's just like, oh, when are you gonna start dying? And then, I mean, when you get jumped, and you, you hit that soup, and then you hit the next soup, and then you just miss it and you die and it's just ugh. oh <laughs> somebody tell me they're a sub one second i gotta say hey hey recording atm wow that's weird Ooh. crap go away skelly got person's asking the team maybe i'll team with them i'm not really sure Okay. Let's jump out and kill this guy. Actually, no, he's running. I wouldn't run a risk it going to chase him. And then end up dying. That's not worth it. In the long run. I mean, if I just keep moving... I'm going to try to keep a fast pace through this cave. Because the quicker I get... Ooh. That ravine looks nice. See, the quicker I get lower down, the safer it is because less people will be like, more people will be like, oh, he's a mile underground, I'll just leave him. Whereas if I'm like just above the surface, they'll be like, oh, I'll just mine down with the fist and then jump him with my, you know, wooden sword. But I got 12 other mates with me who can, you know, kick ass with their wooden swords. <laughs> I mean, when you just get those teams and it's just like, oh, what am I meant to do against you? I mean, I know I do stream teams, but I mean... Stream teams are completely different because, I mean, if you have one stream sniper, they can take down a whole stream. Not because they're good, just because they have the upper advantage of knowing where you are all the time. 
And I mean, when you get those teams that are in like Skype, like four of you communicating, talking it out, you know, know exactly where each other are. When you get that voice communication come into it, that's just like, it, it's hard to counter. Like just, wait, let me see. Sure. I I do love all my subscribers, guys. If you ever see me in a game, don't feel free to say hi. I mean, normally I'm streaming. You can come check out my stream. I'm sure, you guys. I, I hope most of you guys would like talking to me and like kind of person because it's live, so it's kind of like being in person with me. Five, six. I'm gonna grab eight pieces. That should be enough. Except I can never really tell with iron. I never know. I because I think they've moved it up how much coal smelts. Because I swear it used it never used to smelt as much as it does on here. But I'm not really up to date with most of the MCPVP stuff. Most of the MCPVP stuff is told to me by viewers, which I do love. I love when people do that. <sighs> okay, let's put that down. Oh, I'm not going to have enough. Yeah, I can make a hoe. Let's hope this seed gives me more than one seed back. Otherwise, I won't be able to make that much food. Stick these in there for the moment. Okay. Come on, give me more than one seed. Now keep going with the seeds. Keep going. Come this. There we go. We got it working. Got it working. No, I'll just make myself a bit of food. Keep looking above me. What I, what I like is since I'm in such deep ravine, if anybody tries to jump in, they're just going to fall straight to their death. And I'll just sit down here and be like, oh, lol, you dead. You dead, bro. You dead. I didn't even have to kill you. Unless they're Stomper. So I should really stay crouching. So if I just make about what? Yeah, that's about enough bread. I don't really need too much. I mean, in the long run, I'm just really going to use it when I'm running after people. And, you know, you don't want to use up all your soups, because if you use up all your soups while chasing people, you're just... It's annoying. It's about the best way to describe it. Check that stuff away. Okay, now I'm going to need to collect some blocks to get out of here. I'm thinking I'm just going to get some cobble to help me get out of here. Oh! Oh! Neko. That's one of my moderators for my stream. That's weird. Kind of strange to see him in a game. I never thought I'd see that. Oh. <laughs> see the amount of people. I mean, the MCPVP, it seems like there's a lot of people on here, but you notice the same people over and over and over. I mean, that's why when you backstab someone, don't expect. They will backstab you in another game. They will find you somehow. I mean, it is not. It is not hard to find somebody that you know on here. You know, you just bump into people. It's funny. Small world. Small world. Okay, let me make myself that. Make myself some nice pants. Look at how fashionable I'll be. So it's about eight minutes in, so I'm going to have a little time before the feast. So I'm thinking I'll just go massacre some people, go kill some people. What I've got to watch out for is those Urgles. Urgles and stuff will kill me so easily. Or potions, you know, stuff like that. Basically, kits. I've got to watch out for certain kits, because there are so many kits that could easily kill me. So I've really got to be careful. Okay. I still don't see anybody above me. I'm going to try to go out the way I came in. Which, I have no idea what that is. I'm just going to... Well, if I just go to the highest part over here, and then tower up a bit. Ooh, lucky that wasn't a skeleton. I've had it to points where I tower up out of a ravine and then get shot straight back down it. And die. That is the worst feeling ever, when you get killed by mobs, not a human, by a mob. Especially when it's like something newbie, like, you know, you tower one by one up. With a skeleton nearby or something. Like, something that noobs would avoid. Something that you should avoid. People in basic survival would avoid. But you forgot about it because, you know, you're in Hunger Games. Sorry if this is a bit dark, by the way, guys. It's it's always dark when you're underground. You guys must know what it's like. Oh, Nico's a Poseidon. I'll have to find a way to counter him. 
I'm called to- I can grow a tree where he is then. That's my tactic to counter Poseidons. Find a way to block up their water source. Okay. Let's go hunting. Ooh, Neko. I'm gonna jump him before I even know what's hits him. How am I gonna do this? How am I gonna do this? Let's get some mushrooms on the way. He could be in like a team of three though with some of the people that I know from the stream. By the way guys, I, I'm not sure if this is gonna be a win or not. I mean, it's it could be. I mean, there's only 16 people left. Why am I getting... I don't need that out if he's not in water yet. I think I've got to watch out for is he is a Poseidon. Oh, he's dead. He's down. Oh, why the hell does this guy have a wood sword out? Quickly switch the sword. Looks like this guy's monk. I'm going to need to find a way to counter that. Crap. He's just going to monk me in a minute, isn't he? Okay, I'm not sure if I'm going to survive this. Crap. Comboed. Combo, combo, combo. Come on. Run. Dang it. I did not do well there. See, since I'm using a little gaming pad, checking out soups is really hard to do. Okay, since I'm... I'm not really a towering kit, so I'm not going to stay up here. No idea why I accidentally ate that soup there. Hmm. I want to wait till he's out of my area, because I don't really want to fight him until I have a second iron sword. Okay, Kaiser King was the Urgul. I remember that. Oh, did I take any? Yeah, it took some damage. Not too much. Don't worry, don't worry. I'm fine. <clears throat> but yeah, guys, one of the problem with my YouTube is, is I have very bad upload speed, so it takes a while for me to upload, like with that prank video. It, it takes so long to upload, and it's such a pain to do it that I can't get videos out as quick as I would have liked to. Okay, I'm just going to strafe this. I'm going to strafe this. Don't you run. Don't you run. Don't run. Oh, God. He always hits me with that monk. And it's so annoying. That's a good trick, guys. F5 to when you're running. F5 when you're running. I'll probably make a little... Because on my tips videos, I like to give out little tips instead of one big, huge tip on how to do everything. He's going to run right in that gap. Yep. Now he's going to run to the right of that puddle. No, no, he's gone to the left. Again, stop monking me. This guy is so annoying. Monk is possibly one of the most annoying kits in the game. Okay, let's get my sword. Oh, crap. I'm nearly out of soups. I'm going to need a second sword, basically. That's the only way I'm going to take him down. What? He didn't even hit me then on that soup. 
Okay, let's strafe him. Nope. Oh, God. Why didn't that soup? Okay. Let's see if I can... Hmm. I'm not doing too well against this guy. Monk is not one of those kits I'm good against. Oh, God. Oh, what the hell? There's no way that just happened. Okay, let's make my way back to spawn. Let's see if we can get him into a fight with someone else. Or get him stomped by a tower. So if I can get him stomped by a tower. Oh, God, like that guy. Ooh, that was close. As you can see, the commentary is really hard to do. Yep, why? I knew that guy was going to chase me. Just because he knows my stream. Pretty sure a lot of people like to kill me just for that reason. Okay, let's try to do this quick. Soup. Okay, now I know a quite annoying trick for the feast. Which, I tell you what, if I can get enough saplings, I can do this perfectly. And then nobody can stop me. Because if you get a strength 2 potion from that feast, nobody can do anything to you. And I do, if I find a second iron sword, that guy's going down. Hmm. <clears> huh. <throat> Kill that creeper. What a way to go. That's what I hate going by creepers, because they're such a pain. <clears throat> okay. Ooh, there's somebody under the feast. I'm just going to stay away from the minute. What is this guy doing? Come on, I can get him. I'm just gonna chase this guy down. Let's see if Kazer's following. <clears throat> nope, you see, this guy doesn't know what he's doing. Come on, please. Have, oh. if, yes, he had an iron sword. Okay, now I'm gonna keep that right there just in case I need it. Because I'm not 100% sure if I'll ever even see that guy again. For all I know, he's already died to Kazer. Okay, now we're gonna... I, I don't know if this counts as a glitch, but watch this. So you're not allowed to... Let's see if this guy wants a team. Oh. Oh, loads of people watch my stream, apparently. Okay, we made a team. Well, Kazer Cream, thank you for teaming. Enemy. Okay. Yeah, let's go after this guy. So it's cool. I got like a little team now. Some of you guys may be saying, ah, oh, teams aren't that cool, but I, I don't know. I like the teamwork. I'll probably let this guy have the win because he was nice enough to help me out. I mean, I am Cultivator. Where is this guy? What is that going to do? You're going to try to Kaya block me. He doesn't seem to have any kind of soups. Ugh. Ugh. There we go. Ah! Stuck in the block. <laughs> I 
guys towered sorry if like i cut out the commentary halfway through guys and like i just keep stop talking it's it's really hard to commentate over while playing like to what you can't imagine because it's like it's it's trying to hotkey press all those buttons and talk to yourself basically i mean it's like talking to yourself because let's face it it's not like i'm talking to anyone at currently i'm just sitting in the room looking like a weirdo talking to myself He's in a tree. Trying to make a way back in the feast. Ooh, first time as fishman. Sorry, guys. I'm, like, trying to communicate with teammates now. See, normally I would be mean enough to just, you know, chuck a lava bucket on this guy's head while he's looting feast, but I won't be that mean. Nice pair of boots. And that sweet, sweet, sweet diamond sold. Just in case the occasion comes and we need this. Okay, let's enchant this. Sharp bat. Ah, oh, we got knockback. Don't like that knockback. Not ATM. Okay, let's take the enchantment table. Ah, run. Got a second one of those and I don't really want it. Okay. How should we do this? We could actually, let's just be creative. Let's light his tree on fire. It's the bottom of his tree. Is that going to work? Don't think that's going to work, but I'll burn the tree anyway. I need his soups and his mushrooms. I feel a bit bad, but people got to die. I mean, you know what I mean, in game. Oh! Why does this guy come at us and then run? Come on, stop running. Oh god, this is the guy that's towered. What I may do is if he's towered really high and really annoyingly, I may have to come back to you when I kill him. Because, I mean, I've got a pretty good method for taking down towers overall. I mean, if this guy's a noob, like he said, he's the first time towering, I'll just go underneath his tower, crouch for a minute, let's see if he stomps my head. If he doesn't, then I may have to block up and just use water. 
Because, I mean, if you use water when they go to stomp you, all their fall is taken away, so it doesn't really affect you at all, and it's pretty useless. All you gotta watch out for is missing the fall, missing it, and just falling flat on your bottom and dying. Could that be him? Nah, that's not him. That looks like a pretty weirdly shaped tower. Guessing this guy's gonna be at 499 or something stupid. God, he's gonna, isn't he? Let's see, Kazer's behind me. <sighs> what? Oh, there we go. It's end of world. What's happening? Come on, let's get this last guy. This is taking quite a while. This is a long video, guys. I think this is going to be, what, about a 30-minute video? I mean, normally, if it was like a me playing through winning kind of video, I'd speed it up and I'd commentate over the top. But since this is a live commentary, I, I want to keep it like this. Keep myself on my toes, you know. See if I have the skills. <laughs> Which, oh god, it is a tower. Okay, so this is going to take a minute, guys. I'll come back when he's dead or if I die. Hopefully not. Okay, well, surprisingly enough, that guy was pretty... Oh, God, I pressed button. Um, surprisingly enough, all we had to do was go straight up there and kill him. I mean, it took no longer than... Okay. I'll count down. So, yeah, this is the final thing. Here. So this is me versus Kazer Cream. Kazer Cream, this is GG. Good game, bro. If we lose or whatever, it's good game. Well played. We teamed very well. We seem to have killed everyone. For all, we did pretty, pretty, pretty awesome. Just need one more mob. He's enchanting. So we're gonna do Oh god, this server's lagging really, really hard. So yeah, we're just basically gonna do like the normal ones, soup. And then all mushrooms too. Sword model mushrooms too. Ah, <sighs> he's looking okay, I'll come back when Ah, he wants to do it with Splash. I don't like Splash. So, yeah. I'll come back when we're back at the fight. Okay, we are now just about to fight. It's literally been about six seconds. I thought it was going to take a while. Okay. Three. Two. One. Go. Everybody always jumps into the hit, and I don't think they know that that's like the worst thing you can do. Oh! Oh! Good game, Kazer Cream. Good game, dude. That was freaking awesome. That is the joy of a knockback one sword. I mean, that was just whoo, bang. But GG, so guys, I guess this is a Cultivator win game. I mean, honestly, I expected to hit maybe the top 20. I did not expect to win, because, like, I mean, I'm Cultivator, come on. I mean, it's not a very good PvP kit overall, but, I mean, well, see you guys all next time. I hope you guys enjoy this video hell of as much as I do. Love you all. Heart, thank you for subscribing. If you have, if not, it would be very much appreciated if you do. Remember to like, favorite the video, because this took me a long time to do. I mean, it's going to take me a long time to render and stuff, so see you guys all next time. Have a good day. Goodbye.